You want me to teach you how to beat angels? That's what I'm doing. By beating the shit out of me? I'm not used to fighting with long hair. By showing you the flaws in your own fighting style. Yours and all your sisters. Wait, you know I'm an exorcist? How? You have a giant X over your eye and wield an angelic spear. It's not rocket science. Before you found out about me, did you know angels could be harmed? No. <laughs> It shows in how you fight. You leave yourself open with every swing. You fight like someone unafraid of harm. And this is what you'll take advantage of. Angels wield no shields, little armor, and fight with reckless abandon. Strike them here, here, and here. With what? Some secret weapon of yours? Stupid girl, are you really so dense you don't realize you're holding the answer? Angelic weapons? It's that simple? How has no one else figured this out? Angelic steel isn't common, and those who have it aren't exactly rushing off to test it against exorcists. But my daughters and I were cornered in that last extermination. I tried to buy time for my girls to free, and well, you don't become an angelic arms dealer without arming yourself first. Driven by your detestation Your every step is stuck with animus You need a different type of motivation Or there's no way that you can handle this I know you're thirsting for vengeance, Faggy You're out for blood But you'll only stand a chance If you're out for love Out for love You're out for blood, but you'll only stand a chance if you're out for love. Out for love, oh, 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 love, love. Think of who you care about. Protect them and be out for love, love. You're gonna fight without gloves, and when that push comes to shove, yeah, you just might rise above. Long as you're out for love. Well, look at that. You might just survive this. We're gonna need more weapons.